When his father dies in 1857, Willie takes over supporting the family. He doesn't apparently ride for the Pony Express, but he is working as a, as a lad to keep his mother and sisters alive. When the National Civil War comes, Willie joins the, at first he joins an informal group of what were known as red legs, um, uh, Jayhawkers. These are Kansans, as Cody admits in his autobiography, who they feel the Missourians picked on them in the Kansas Civil War and the National Civil War is their opportunity to cross the border east into Missouri and get their revenge. Uh, so he's, he's in an informal Jayhawking Kansas regiment fighting in Missouri. And then 1864, he joins the Kansas 7th, which is the notorious Jayhawking regiment. If you were a Missourian and I said Kansas 7th, you would know what that meant, even probably today. And they had such a bad reputation for the depredations they were carrying out in Missouri that they got sent away from the Kansas-Missouri border. Uh, he did see some service in the South, and by the end of the war, he's back in St. Louis. Well, what did Buffalo Bill's childhood in bleeding Kansas and in his youth as a Jayhawker in the Civil War mean to him? 